Okay. We're on Ocean Drive again. The rain has come and gone. It is Friday. No, it's not. It's Saturday, February 6th. Tomorrow is the Super Bowl. And yes, the uh, about uh, one o'clock, one o'clock today, the, the heavens opened up with some very large downpours. So it rained, good, good hard rain, hard, hard rain from one o'clock till about 3.30 or so. And now it's about getting on about 5 36 o'clock so we're gonna take a walk down uh, down Ocean Drive to see what's going on kind of the same old same old we're here at 12th Street the crowd has come back out now that the uh, the rain has ended Before the rain came, it was beautiful today. I mean, it was 79, 78, 79 degrees, and the beach was alive. Hotel Victor, they seem to they seem to do it upright. I'm gonna have to stay here sometime. They got the nice cafe out here on front. They got the two towers, and then the the pool, the pool, I don't know if you can see it there, but there's a pool up on uh, on the first deck there. Of course, overlooking the ocean. Go Cardinals. But yeah, the uh, Hotel Victor would be one to check out. I've never stayed there. I haven't really read any reviews about it either. Great location, right there between 11th and 12th Street, right next door to the Versace Mansion. It's gonna be a slow walk. I'm walking slow today. But we'll try to check things out. We'll do a little bit more detailed exploring at each place, maybe. Versace Mansion is open for fine dining tonight. Reservations required. I did see online that the uh, that the bed and breakfast Casa 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 Maria. I think I got it right. I don't know. I don't know if I got the right. Did have availability for tonight. I think it was uh, four thousand dollars for one night or something like that. Let's see. And yes, the police did promise some ups, updated, some uh, more improved police presence down here. And it was a, I did witness it last night and then I can see it again here tonight. They had a couple of, a couple of handfuls of uh, violence down here that really scared some people. So the mayor and the police chief and others vowed to Stomp it down immediately. So here's Sugar Factory. They got a nice setup here. In the Bon Air building. Sugar Factory. Of course they used to be a couple blocks down the uh down the road. Hey, hey, hey. And then, uh, and then Pitbull got involved in this Bon Air building with the uh, I Love 305 restaurant. And then all of a sudden, Sugar Factory took over. So I've I've lost track on what who the hell owns what there. And then here's the palace. The palace is uh, has uh, got a nice. Uh, homeless living shelter across the street from it now and 
I think the rain must have killed uh, brunch number two today. I don't know. Should have been a Saturday brunch today at the palace. We can see up here. Let's see. Here's the Congress Hotel, and boy, I don't know if you can just barely see up on top of the palace there. They got a rooftop pool up there with a bar. I don't know. Let's check and see. Can we even go up there if we wanted to go up there? Yeah, it's open. No mask, no entry. Pool bar. Let's see if he would let me go. I'm not going up there anyway because they don't have a damn... Uh... They got an elevator to the top or no? Uh, you got to go all the way down. You got to up, up to the pool bar. Oh, okay, cool. All right, well, at least they got the elevator fixed to get up there. Last time I was here, I had to walk up the stairs, but uh, I, don't, I don't have the energy to... Nor do I want to go up there right now. We're... Doing a video of Ocean Drive, goddammit. Get back out on Ocean Drive and finish it up and then go up to the pool bar. I'm gonna put that into check for re future reference. <laughs> so tomorrow is the Super Bowl. Of course, the Super Bowl was hosted in Miami last year. They're in Tampa this year. And here was... Uh, ESPN headquarters last year was here at the Cleveland. <laughs> and they're going to try to be football headquarters tomorrow again for, for the Super Bowl out of Tampa. So yeah, the uh, the rain has thinned things out. There was nobody down here about an hour and a half ago. Now, the crowd is picking up. The weather forecast is for continued dryness. It's gonna be sunny and 79 degrees tomorrow. There's our police, police officers helping us out here. We can see. February 6, 75 degrees. And we got the break water. Oh yeah, the restaurants and bars haven't picked up any afternoon crowd yet, but the streets certainly have become alive. BYOB, as they say. Uh-oh, now I feel a few raindrops. Uh, but it's not supposed to be. But in Miami, you never know. Especially out here on the island. You 
get a crop up shower any moment. As they say, it's only water. And yeah, I was out at Muscle Beach earlier today. <clears throat> Between the hours of 10 and noon, let's say. And it was packed with people. And then when the rain came, everybody disappeared. All right, we're gonna get a nighttime video later, <clears throat> later tonight. So let's leave it there for right now. <clears throat>